the omnipotent God. There is nothing too hard for him. Whatever he thinks he does, whatever he says he performs, celebrate and magnify him this morning. In Jesus' precious name, we have given thanks. Amen. The psalmist prayed, Open my eyes, Lord, that I may see the wonders packaged in your world for me. No one ever doubts what he sees. What we doubt are things we are yet to see. The dumbest person on earth will not need any conviction to believe what he sees. The things we doubt are proofs of things we are yet to see. And it takes meekness to agree. I can't see it and not believe it. I can't believe it and not become it. The destiny of every believer is packaged in the book. But you only realize as far as your eyes can see. Is there, but until you see it, you can't have it. Until I see it, I can't have it. I saw I was redeemed as a priest and a king to reign on the earth. At the age of 16, I saw it. I saw my royalty in redemption. It impacted on my thinking pattern and my actions. I saw that my future is in his plan, not in my plan. So I wait on him to locate his plan. It's been gorgeous these few years. You can't see your picture from scriptures and doubt it. The things you doubt are things you are yet to see. You better agree. Even Thomas, when Jesus showed up, my Lord and my God, there are people sitting down here today that nothing moves them, no matter what you say. They can't see it. When I saw heat free marriage, I received it. It was strange then. Marriage was warfare. The way I met it. When I saw it, I began to declare what I saw, they thought I was mad. Let's watch when he gets married. They have been watching. And make it here no double. Please pray this prayer from your heart. Lord, open my eyes to see my picture from your word. Open my eyes to see my picture from the pages of scriptures as you declare your word this morning. Open my eyes, Jesus. For I can only realize as far as I can see. 
open my eyes to realize In Jesus' precious name, we have prayed. Lord Jesus, we are here at your feet. Open our eyes. To see what you are showing us from your word. And thank you for it. We know you are covenant keeping God. We can't see it and not believe it. We can't believe it and not have it. Therefore, Lord, just open the eyes of all this morning. Amen. And let your name be glorified. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Give the Lord a big hand of praise and get seated, please. This is a very powerful video by Bishop David Oedebo. Welcome to the commentary section of this video where we make powerful analysis about what the preacher was talking about. So um, this video is a very challenging one because a lot of persons have not gotten their picture from the scripture. A lot of persons have not gotten what God is saying to them per time from the scripture. And um, this video is mainly for believers, believers who are finding difficult to understand their identity. And this was a very powerful statement that Bishop Oyeko made when you're talking about how he saw himself as a king and as a priest at the age of 16. So what are we saying? God can show you who you are if only you are willing to hear from him. Look at the case of Joseph also. So God, God is willing to show you who you are, but a lot of the times, a lot of persons are not willing already to listen. A lot of persons are not um, interested to settle down and hear what God is saying. So most of the times when we seek the face of God, God is always willing to speak. It depends on how interested we are to listen. Most times, a lot of persons feel like ah, that uh, God is slow. His reaction is slow he doesn't respond in time and things like that but the good news is when you wait on god as the bible says he will renew our strength so so if you want to get renewed if you want to get energized then let us wait on him wait on him for the scripture what is god saying to us from the scriptures what is the prophecy of god over our life what is the prophecy of god what's the um, uh, his word over our destiny and as you start studying it will begin to give you insight and revelation and as it gives you revelation it begins to illuminate your mind it begins to give you deep understanding beyond what the flesh can comprehend i pray god will help us that as we start feasting on the word uh, we begin to see the picture from the scriptures in the name of Jesus. I'm sure I've played a powerful video. Please take your time, go over again and watch the video, and do have a great time. Like also if you are blessed, comment if you are also blessed, and subscribe to see more content like this. You are blessed and have a great time. God bless you.